Father, we give you glory, we give you praise, we give you honor and adoration. Spirit of the living God, take precedent in our spiritual mind, eyes, body, and soul. Take hold, take charge of every fiber of our being, of every fiber of our being. Take hold of us in Jesus' mighty name. Take hold of us in Jesus Christ's mighty name. Grant us understanding, spiritual understanding, and let our spirit being be filled with enough knowledge of you tonight so that we walk as saints of God with understanding and deeper revelation. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 We thank the living God um, every day. He does great things and new things. Let's take our Bibles. We are going to learn. We are here to have our spirit being revived and restored to the original intent that God chose and made us to be. Hallelujah. Please, when you get time, try and listen to the uh, afternoon service audios because a lot was given in the afternoon and we are even going to expand more we are going to expand more on what was taught in the afternoon hallelujah mm-hmm. you see every time that the word of god comes the more you think about it the more he's putting all the branches other things you know greater things so after the word i will listen back and the lord either Whatever maybe I said, and the actual thing you will tell me, okay, this one you should have said it this way, this one you should have put it this way, this one add this to it. He's a good God, hallelujah. He is a wonderful God. He wants us to be fully equipped. He wants us to be fully equipped, equipped with what? With the knowledge of Him, hallelujah. With the knowledge of Him, Christ Jesus. Because until we are filled with the full knowledge and great knowledge of Jesus Christ, our spirit being will keep on behaving like a baby. You know, immature person. We are still going to be wallowing in imperfection. But if we are taking in every day, little by little, one day at a time, our spiritual being is going to be fully mature, who understand spiritual matters, and we we'll know everything the Spirit of God is releasing to you. you he would give you direction how to move about, how to do things. And we are going to do it accordingly. And we will walk before God and be made perfect. Even as he, he told that to Abraham. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. At least the from faith to faith. from to so nya me ka jose ko pa wa shwam prese de be u be nya me mu nim die hallelujah in the afternoon the lord god through his infinite mercies made us to understand that we are three entities as a human being there are three compartments or three department of our being that makes us a living soul a living soul so we have the physical body the one that you can see right now, the physical body. We have the soul and then we have the spirit. We are made of three. 
spirit, soul, and body. And the Lord was gracious to us. Let's go to First Thessalonians. We are going to add up to what was taught. And that's why I just want to reference something little from it. So everything Jesus is teaching us is all scriptural. Everything is in the Bible. Because it's teachings, we don't want to rush through it. We just want to open the scriptures and get deeper understanding. First Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 23. And I read in Jesus' name. He says that, and the very God of peace sanctify you wholly. And I pray God, your whole spirit. See, so he started mentioning the, the three departments of man. Your whole spirit, one, and soul, two, and body. Spirit and soul and body. Be preserved blameless unto the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. So, in fact, you can even add this to your prayer, your prayer point every day. That, Lord Jesus, may you preserve my spirit, my soul, and my body unto, until your second what? Coming. Because you are three, you are three in nature. Hallelujah. You are three in nature. Yeah. And Thessalonica, no man, a decano, a tea, ye, a noon, you move a drunum, ye and Sahono. Hallelujah. Until a genie be a new one. The man, Jehovah witness, if you are my country, so you only, only crabby, and now we are just nipper, be a new one. As I said, Jehovah for any uncle for fee, etch and church, bonny. Any Adam Crufubi, so much church and church, bonny, a dinipa call, say him. So when to me, eh, so we any pebriaqua, me and son. Or for your mere summary, who bet yad 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 and make it sense. And toss me more da. And I'm also so to untimil to man in ye da. I didn't hear a sense of unintias ye. Unim baby on tias yan cry a day. A free ba. Be o say, O nipper be a quam baby o say, among yantias yan unim. You know, say a brubus or a jumana unimua. Yanko nadiatri, yamo nadiatri. The million from a pimp bet me a baboo. Hallelujah. So all this that we are learning, it is not for the fun of it. It's not because we have no other better thing to teach. But until we know this basic foundation, we know what we are made of, you can't take the higher level teachings because the understanding will not be right. If the foundation is not laid, you can't build upon what is not there. Hallelujah. You cannot do what? You cannot build on what is not there. What doesn't have a what a laid down foundation? It is going to crash eventually. It is going to crash. So let's get that done. And the Lord made us to understand that the body uses five senses in order to operate in the physical realm. It is this physical body that operates in this what you can see and touch in this physical world in this physical or material world. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. And the five senses are your eyes, your sight, your eyes, your smell. You're able to smell things through your nose. Your taste. You're able to taste something. It's your tongue inside your mouth. Your ears. You're able to hear. When, as I'm talking, you're able to hear me. You are using what? Your physical, uh, this part of your physical nature that is what your ears and then we have the sense of touch and that is through that lay the first layer of your skin and so as women you go to the kitchen and maybe by mistake your hand touches the fire or a, hot, a very hot mm -hmm. pot what will happen yes. it will send signal that uh, the body has what has something that is supposed not to touch and it, there will be an immediate reaction whereby you pull from that 
place or that thing that is what hurting that skin or that flesh of yours. And so through that, we are able to what? Operate in the physical. Through these five things, we are able to operate your eyes, your smell, your nose, your ears, your tongue, which is for taste, and this flesh, this uh, first layer of your body for touching and for feelings, whichever way we want to put it. Hallelujah. The body, Ed Timmy edit na se ewa hunam yasi. Ana se eh yasia ye ni e de ye hunameni et timi hu adeno. Ye ni pedwe enam anyama enumso. Enani wen ni a wodi sha adie mi hun usu ye de uhum me yen na banya mi fi ubi e hun yonku ye de yenina e de e shisha yon. A feme kasana wote wote mini wodi u dianeti wudi wasu any eight ye and a sound nene e rim. I face a environment one say a grabia would a wa best that is a day a bomb into no better sa pampan old woman and a day a smelly sa a pampano. Now is not why you would be any means on would touch him at least he sent him say and chin him say a papa say and your papa would touch him at a day a fa sa I didn't acquire not what me uh I have say at Sayana and I think so yeah war in Pediano the first lady and also Uti midi eta chibibi, so bibi mo se inu inu pa wose vetu na huo si adi di inu amadi be awode mi na se eshi pa nswa ukan yana nswa ede vetu na si adi di eshi ede eshi sheme mimpe ha tina nusu no eka hutachi no ni adi yangu ede eka ema ede ema ya communication kan bichele yeng se eti se anasa debe eti se wengine adi adi ede eshi Beloved, we also have the soul, the soul of a man. And in the soul of a man, the Lord also taught us that the soul is the department where your conscience, your conscience, where you become, and that is what the science and other people will call it, your common sense. That is the department or the faculty where your common sense exists. So your brain, this the physical brain in you, is connected to your soul. Everything is happening in your soul, within your soul. Hallelujah, within your soul. That is where you 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 have that common sense, and that conscience is where you are able to say this is right and this is wrong. This is right and this is wrong. Hallelujah. And then, in the same soul being, in that same soul department, we also have where what we call reasoning, reason whereby you are, somebody will come and tell you something and then you tell the person, oh, go and come tomorrow. I'm going to think about it. Where are you thinking from? It is within your soul. It is the soul that is doing the thought process, reasoning, to reason through and see whether to go forward, whether to stop, whether to do whatever. It is from your soul. Your mind reasons. Hallelujah. In the same department is where we have the emotions or affections. The emotions or affection. This is where you develop love for the husband, the wife, your children, you know, for your sister, your brother, the brother in Christ, the sister. It is through your soul that that connection happens. And if a brother smack you in the face, for it to hurt you so deep that you react and what? smack the person back or curse the person out. It happens in your soul. Your soul will reason and say, ah, this my sister didn't do well at all. Look at the way he or she, she smacked me. And that faculty will say, okay, go and smack her back or go and insult her. Let her know that you too, you are somebody. You are something. And so it is the soul that is doing that work. It is the department of that soul that is causing all those things. So your conscience, your reasoning, and then we have the memory. See, right from childhood, there are some things up to date you remember. You did right in your childhood. Maybe you were, you were two years or three years old. But even in your, at your age, whatever current age you are, you can still remember something right from childhood. It is the soul that keeps that memory. It is the soul. 
everything is bare to the soul. Everything you did from childhood to the time that you die, the soul remembers everything. The soul will never forget it. Sometimes, maybe due to some conditions or situation, you might think you've forgotten. No, it never. The soul never forgets. The soul never forgets. It is there. The Lord, maybe through His uh, infinite power, might let it, you know, be forgotten temporarily. But your soul always remembers. That is one thing. That is how special the Lord has what made that uh, department of your body. Hallelujah. So your your conscience, your memory, your reason, and affections. And then we have what we call imagination. Remember when we were um, doing the other teachings, I, I kept saying that as you are reading the word of God, begin to imagine it, meaning begin to picture it out. Where is that imagination going to come from? It is from your soul. Your soul is going to follow through and begin to what? Picture it out. It's just like a dream happening. Just like when you go to bed, the physical being lays down, but the, the soul will get up and start roaming. And then you'll be like, was I imagining it? Was that, was that a dream? The soul does all those things. Hallelujah. Until we get that understanding, when someone tells you, begin to imagine, you don't know where you are imagining from. You need to understand that, oh, my soul, begin to imagine this. You need to tell, speak to that soul and tell him, I need you to follow through the word of God. And give me a clear picture of what I want to understand. And the soul, because it is her job or his job, he, he or she will start doing it. Give you that imagination. And if your spirit and the spirit of God is in sync, right sync, power will follow. So to, for you to understand what was already taught, you need to understand what part of your being is supposed to do what. Hallelujah. And that's why it's important we talk about it. And then we have this, uh, the spirit, the spirit of a man. And the spirit of the man receives impression for the spirit of a man, for whatever action the spirit of a man will take, for it to demonstrate physically, it connects through the soul. The spirit of the man will connect through the soul. And in the spirit of a man, these are the things, these are some of the things that happens there. In your spirit is where you try to have faith. Your spirit being is where your faith lies. Your faith. So somebody say, oh, I used to be an idol worshiper. Now my new faith is Jesus Christ. Which of their being, which of their being connected and accepted Jesus Christ? It is your spirit being. It's your spiritual man. The inner man that is within you that accepted Jesus. Because the spirit being is always craving and yearning to connect to a higher power. The spirit man in you, it is always looking for a way to connect to the, the creator. And that is how God made it. Because the Lord also taught us that the spirit was given by God. God is a spirit. He has already taught us that. And so every spirit came from him, came from above heaven. And so, due to sin, there was a separation between the spirit of man and the spirit of God. And so now, as we live on this earth, the spirit being is searching to connect back to the creator. So in that spirit department is where you have faith. Faith in who? God Almighty. And the rest who has not opened them, their spirit up to, to accept the creator and his son, you see that they are trying still they have a spiritual hunger in them. And so they will connect. Some, somebody will tell you, oh, I believe I have faith in Mother Earth. And so Mother Earth is my God. I have faith in nature. Nature is what? My God. And then you see the Church of Scientology and all those people. They are, every human being, the spirit being is trying to connect to the higher power. That is the function of the spirit, trying to connect back to where he came from, he or she came from. And that is why we have so many religions and practices and beliefs. So in the spirit, in your spirit being, is where you have faith, is where you have hope. Hope is what? What you have not seen, yet you believe that it exists or you believe that you can have. 
Hallelujah. It is that department, that spiritual being within you, within your soul. That is why hoping, yearning, believing that there is something that you must attain. There is a reward waiting for you. And it's always desiring for it. Your spiritual being is the one that has that. That does that within us. Hallelujah. And then it gives reverence to who? To God. It gives reverence, respect to who? To your fellow human being. It is your spiritual being that does that. It also does prayer. You see that sometimes you, you feel within you some groaning. The need to connect, to pray. To who? To the creator. To the higher power. And so people will be trying to just shut in their brain and everything, noises from outside. They are trying to connect within. They are trying to meditate. They are trying to pray within. What are they trying to connect to? They've been deceived that they have to connect to their own spirit and their spirit will give them more power to do whatever. No, you don't try to connect to your own. You're already connected to your spirit. But your spirit is trying to connect to the higher power, which is what? God. And so those people who have been deceived, they have, whenever they become that focus and connecting to their spirit, another spirit will enter them and possess them. And that is why many spiritual preachers will tell you that yoga and all those things, that teaches meditation, which is not centered on Christ, but on other things, it brings demonic possession. Hallelujah. It brings demonic possession because it doesn't make the focus about God nor his son, Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. So it is your spiritual being that tends to worship. Sometimes you are there, you, you feel worship. You, you, you want to worship God so bad. And so you'll be singing through and through. You'll be singing. It is not your soul, nor is, is it your body. It is the spirit man within you that is having that yearning and the craving to what? To worship. Hallelujah. So these are the functions of the three parts of your body that makes you a living soul. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> Bunse <laughs> Okrano <laughs> And so, and then they had the innermost share a crown, the inner of the inner crown. Aha, then on Sahon, and no moon, and a yaw giddy, which mean ya giddy said, Yamibi or I was a weird question at Chiraquan. Sans a Sahon, no in your minute. A home nature and in your coupon, and noa, ye establishes our factor. A home nature to whom you are men at the mouth. And so Adam Bonnie and Eddie Debbie. Yen tem emma yen in your me et tea. Hunt in debiano or cra or whom whom no, debia or presser debe or besser connette. Amma a jam, debia or free bayan. Tino a binum, a whom nun yam me a somebody dear or boa de nan atum, two boys or so or so as I say ya, boss will goon, sir, or yen near my ye or the or want to try to say the nanami yet illustration. He said, I said, the more ya won't for none and yet the or when my men of Bose, so when we're the Mabada, was ordinary Tiba Pimpim, Sana, Nippa Bibri, whom I what do you want to tread the sun? What do you tip in Pimps? No Cosumia, no Cosum, near Yakavi, no Cosum, the Ayadotia, as I see ya, Munyan Sanum, a Yan Anonim, 
eya hunzo na tini mu no nipa no hunu e na e try say the oni nya me be ye de be connect bi na so no no hunu no emu nya mi se e be de e be ji nya me ni doba na odi ama ye se be ya sa connection e be sa be bi no onya nyi ntumtumu bo se odi na ni pimpim sa e pimpim sa o hwehwe nkwade ye nti de mu e na nya gidi e mu ni nya hope e di da so hunu no ni nya reverence ye di ni di e e ma sa utumfo no Aye nyang kupono, anasi ni adikrona ni pani dene rea idea asimu no se biya no ni ni nyami ane no ni ebe jine kwanu ha hum hum ni mu ene ye bom paye ye hum hum ifri ye hum hum ne ede ye bom paye ifri ye hum hum ne ede ye bom paye ifri ye hum hum ne sorry nyami ifri ya jine mu ifri ye hum hum ene ede ya di sorry ya urade inti ne awase ya tia se se biya nyami ya se mne ba ube hum biya biya di ede esese ti ya mi asen ba wo hunhun na bebi because am kra me hunhun ti urade ni ti urade asem ne nyante ase wo banya mi fi a wo bompa ya o si urade bi bi mi hunhun e ma bi hunhun no na dwene hunhun no wa dwene hunhun ne ti sa wo body no pepepe de se hunhun no hun o wa form ti se ni pedu ya no pepepe pepepe na so nyede wo mfa wani hun no ko ti ni pedu ya no inside pa Hallelujah. Now we are the illustration here. The kushia are the one. And the illustration. Kushia no one of the kind of pan is here. And then we need to be on. Fit on. White on. And then the crown. The soul. And a yoke no yellow. You who yoke here fit on that they be yellow. So fit on what they are mini. Yellow yoke no. And then the spirit no. Ah yeah. Oh oh oh. Hallelujah. And the witness say Jesus Jesus. And say Mr. Nache say no. I connect yama. Uni pedua e yinu mi ensano se ne juma e de e ye praise the Lord. And so the Lord is teaching us that so that we will know how He has what made us, how He has made us. And today we uh, tonight we are just expanding on it a little bit. We are just as this is the the foundation of it. So as we've spoken about it, we just want to expand on it by adding uh, some other things that will make you understand the reason for your calling he the lord wants us to understand that that spiritual being that spirit and the soul they are fully grown they are full grown beings hallelujah they are full grown beings and i'm going to explain what i'm talking about you see in Genesis chapter 2, verse 7. Let's go to Genesis chapter 2, verse 7. Genesis 2, 7. And the Lord God formed man of the dust of the ground and breathed into his nostrils the breath of life. And man became a living soul. Beloved, from this very verse, I can confidently and boldly believe that what God actually created was a soul. And God covered the soul with the dust, which is the earth. God created a full grown soul, a whole being, and covered it with what? The dust. Because the soul itself, if it's standing, it cannot see the physical. It cannot operate in the physical. So for it to operate in the physical, God had to give it a coat. God has to what? Cover it and put a coat around it, a physical coat around it, so that the soul can what? Be fully seen in the physical to dominate and do everything God wants it, him to do. And so if God formed man, who is man? The soul. The soul of the man is that man. Amen. And he breathed into he breathed into him the breath of life. A man became a living soul. So for their soul and the physical coat, which is this body, to stand up, to begin to speak, to walk, to do everything, he needed a spirit. And so God gave that spirit into the soul, and he became a living soul in the spiritual realm. Your soul operates. Your soul and your spirit operate. Without your spirit, your soul is dead. 
Amen. Get that understanding. Without your soul, without the spirit being, your soul is dead. It cannot function. And without the body, the soul cannot function in the physical. Hallelujah. Without your physical being, your soul can never be seen in the physical. And so if you have watched, you know, these movies where they have ghosts, they have ghosts in it. You see that when the person died, another person looking just like that person gets up from the body. That is the soul. And in that soul that God up is the spirit of that soul. Hallelujah. Is the spirit. The spirit made that soul together. But this time without the physical body. So the physical body will be lying down, but the soul will be what? Standing up. Hallelujah. And at that point, no physical human being can see that soul again. Because why? Because he is not in the physical element. He's not covered up in that jacket God created for him or her, which is the body. And so always remember, your body is like a jacket, like you getting out and it's cold, and then you put on a jacket to cover up your what? Your physical skin. Hallelujah. Your body is the life jacket of your soul in order for your soul to operate in the physical. Does it make sense, somebody? Amen. He's teaching us something. It is going to co connect to the word of God that he's enlightening us on so that you know how things operate both in the physical and in the spiritual. If we don't get this part, we will never understand the word of God going forward. Hallelujah. From most of the kind of it, yeah, yeah, uh, me, no, emu, a year and son. Or say, Yanko Pond, the form of the new nipper, the Ohu, Quahome, a day, a good nippermo, the nipper bay, a day, or cratty as a fool, or the or the form of the new nipper, nipper no body, nipper no one, a yokra, or cran or the form of the day, a covan, a chicken, seven ya, or cran, a bit in me, a gina. Ewo hunam viasi amana yeye okra ne kasa emu ane bete nene because ata no emu ane no abom na opese nipa okra ne eti midi emu ane so enya di biya wa yeso hallelujah na opese okra no eti mi eden esa kambi bi emani yeye eso bi bi mo ede e yeye ewo hunam viasi ya ne radi ede abo na odi so na oye ne ni emase onu ni ame pepe pepe esa nse obo ye esa ni su Eddie de Bay, the Bainso. Hallelujah. O born yes, Missou, and then a Bainso. Ha. Na I will hum 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 yasin, O cram, and a year juma, I will hum hum yasin. But O cram a bit my year juma will hum hum yasia. This I will hum hum at a cranny. Hallelujah. This I will hum hum a day at a cranny. And Sana will cram my dear bay or cra tiasifu. Say hum hum a free or cranny more. We are cra tiasifu. We woman. Hallelujah. Now, yes, the bitch, the mufeda. I'm anti as I am because I was saying, if you are the final destination, maybe a year ago, and the ABC, you better talk, you better talk, you better talk, you better Praise the Lord. Ha. To me, you're not basic in Tiasia, and I'm not saying you can be a Becky can't be the same at the night. I can't say, if they be a boon say, now may ever add the apple, and I will be the apple GD. I will name. I feel you may be a moon who be. <laughs> Hallelujah. Again, the Lord made us to understand that we were created to fulfill his purpose. We were created as in his likeness and his image to be just like him, to carry him, his glory, inside of us. So we are containers, we are like vessels who we are supposed to contain God in us. Hallelujah. We are supposed to contain what? God in us. And beloved, what, what is God? What is he made of? God is life and light. He's life and light. He said in John chapter 1, verse 4, in him is life. 
Let's go to John chapter one. Let's go there quickly. He's enlightening us today. Hallelujah. John chapter one, verse four. John chapter one, verse four. In him was life, and the life was the light of men. This is just a tip of it. In God is life, and that life is the light of men. So in God, we have life, and we have what? Light. So if we were created in the image and the likeness of what God, then what just happened? God created man. And then man became what? A living soul. Man had what? Life. Man got life through who? Through God. He had to what? Breathe into us. I pray that I'm not confusing you. <laughs> I really pray that you are catching what the Lord is teaching us. Mama Rebecca, I hope you are understanding. <laughs> yes. So for us to be a living body and a living soul, God has to what? Breathe into us. And that is why we can confidently say that we are in the image and the likeness of God. Therefore, a man can't go for casting and say, In fact, Yame, now a person who nipa, or who said, or Henno, he said, Ye, Wunipa, could not mirror more, who said, Was one a gina mirror ni mo. Sane, but I ain't here, Yame, a boy, not a person on your bushina, into a hunya, no a hunny, a way, hallelujah, into a boy, ni soup, any dean, ni pineso, a boy, ni soup, any ni pineso, into ni sooner than a bino, he said, Nipa. Our day, not ye any affa or cran hono. Now, fain for a cran on his adult ye, a bit me, I yen a binding is susono, or say, and quambem. And I they call you Henias and pay tea back when you moon and say, Nimuna de bay, and quaw, and quani de bay, or nipa hang. In tea, Yamimuno, a dinner when Yamim, who says, O people say, and Yamino crano, a dinner, a dinner when dinner money in Yami, who sing Yami or your hang and unqua. Hallelujah. A Christophobe blame him sadly. Today, best that your Bible quiz. You say, "What is God made of?" I was so weird, Timika. Hallelujah. You say, "Nyami, nyami, munodi ene timua." I was so Timika. Say, according to John chapter one verse four, ni mu ena unkwa o ene saye hain ni mu na unkwa ene hain ewo. Hallelujah. Ni mu na debe unkwa ene hain. This unkwa no ene odima adasa odima okra ene ema okra ne baye debe tiasifu. Inti. Bibia or Namasa season. Say or Ginia Midu, so Nina Minu, so ye yes to do so the ordinant and a home my tinimon, Namena de man. Namena mo pian quan opera. Quana a woe be a moon, Nipa Mamun, Namena de Adiama, the yesu Casano. Or say into a tone so good debate at the boy for so near the bay, a papa for so at an air for so. Oton so go a crane in our so adentia, ni muna or enquire what a cramuno, Eddie, if you buy. Hallelujah. When Tia say when they are my say any day, young, young, baby, if you any dear team, praise the Lord, any dear day, or dear Asseni Pamansa, in dinner, or boy, send you soon any bind so, say, young mess, ne new yam, young mess for ten new yam. The new me. You who show more mirror more. First, what do you say? Say, Nana Mitty. So, by a enemy yard, but then a dinner, no sound says, Say, and a yamitty. Yammy a hind or young quack. Say, Yammy a hind young quack. Now be one, no, not a mogwonsum, any a woony man out, oh, can't ya. Any now he sounds say, Yammy soon. Praise God. Hallelujah. In God is life, and in God is light. In him is no darkness. And that is why in the middle of darkness and chaos, because he is light, he called the light. He said, come forth light. Let there be what? Light. We are in the nature and the likeness of what? God. That is how he made us. And so you, who is now being given this understanding, 
you need to walk in the light that he gave to you from the original the origin before time immemorial he gave you light and life and so your mouth cannot be speaking what dark things your mouth cannot be what speaking dark things your mouth cannot be speaking about uh, uh, death about death oh i feel like i'm going no you tell your spirit you tell your soul you shall not die but you shall live and to what to declare the goodness of god why because you are made in the image and the likeness of god and he has his breath in you and his breath is life and light are we gaining understanding oh, yeah. you shall know the truth and the truth shall what set you free and so any day, any night, you dreamt and something was chasing you and even you felt like your head was cut off. You got up in the morning. If your head was indeed cut off, you would never have gotten up. And so when you get up, let your spirit minister to your soul and tell your soul, soul and body, be still and know that he is God. He created you in his image and his likeness and in him is life. And that life is my light. Is the light of men. And so nothing can by any means what hurt you. Hallelujah. It is about time we, we renew our mind, our soul, to conform to the word of God so that the word of God will come alive to us. Say, Babo ne so ne sesso and then a bind so the a free necro said the all children who baby or do a genano ni baby or ye who free and baby what joe do a baby a mass at a and and chin fowl should be a man and one in a day and chin fowl crash should be sir ni mu and unquam a radiwa mammy in qua mamma in qua a yede any a wee mamma in qua no mamma in qua any dear bay a wee and to make Jessa semidi into a bonny phone in your day, or name it so to me be. Sansa Wumu, Wumuna men yaminqua. And now, as I get a higher high yamami. Proverbs twenty three. Let's go to Proverbs twenty three. Verse seven. Proverbs twenty three, verse seven. Hallelujah. Proverbs twenty three, verse seven. For as he thinketh in his heart, so is he. Eat and drink, said he to thee, but his heart is not with thee. Amen. As a man is thinking, so is he. If your soul accepts that you are a dead being, you will die. But if your spirit will minister to your soul that you shall not die stop thinking negative and think positive because the god of all flesh of all spirits is always looking at the bright side is always looking out for the best of man and he is love he's not god of hate he's god of love he's the embodiment of love hallelujah as a man thinketh so is he and every day whatever you feed your your soul with because i've we've already established that the the mindset the brain our thinking thought everything is in the soul so as you are thinking that is how your soul is that is what your soul is what thinking so every day whatever it is that you are allowing to enter into your ears every day you so you shall become you become that thing hallelujah or for you know until you see from you start to say yeah because everybody says our church and say okra nimu and i had journey i drink drink and then you may be a right here day a bad dream lady and what okra nimu nasisi also you can you know you know me busa me tia edu no me and sound you know you said you need part you know you also show on a common sarah not here Said you who so sad now, dear. You be connected, Amma, and you may be away and brabum. Sansa was saying, "I'm here, Sam, to be connected, my. And I am practical. 
na yesi ya beto ananisem. Ose wuko no di kou fino. Uti midi susu nye mabia waye ye, wake kan, ni nye mabia ACC. Na wuhu, mfu mfu wano mre ye, na wajitu, na wupanya mecho wuhu, na efine wuko wuyen si esi ye. Hallelujah. So, I live with my children. I am a mother of three. And out of ignorance, and in my ignorance, I am always telling my sons, I have two boys and a girl, I'm always telling my children, you, you are very stupid. Every day, I will be spewing that word to my son. You are what? Very stupid. You are foolish. You amount to nothing. Then I spew from my mouth all these negative words. Our words also hold power. Every living soul, your word holds power. Why is your word holding power? I will tell you why. In the book of Genesis chapter 2, when God created man, Genesis 1, 23, and God said, and let them have dominion over everything we have created. So man had dominion over everything. And when man spoke, Bible says, every word that came out of Adam, every name he gave to animals, so it was up to date. Hallelujah. This is the secret of the kingdom that many people don't know. Our words are holding as bondage. The very word that we are spewing out of our mouth every single day is holding us what? Captive. Man called tiger, tiger. And today, that animal is so called what? Tiger. It hasn't changed to look at. It is what? Tiger. So as God declared, and the heaven and earth was established, so mankind also declared, and animals and other things that we have dominion over, has what been established? Please, are, are we getting understanding here? We are we are getting to somewhere with this thing. But of what you know, my son, no, I could have to me. I didn't hear. The son said, "Your boy, you know, or the two me be a rayemu." You did can establish your boy, yeah, that that when a boy, you are coping. You are quite worried, you know. You are home, you know, one. You are home, you know, home, you know, papa. Okay, Genesis 1, 23, 26, one. I say, you are one of you, you are one of so. The book, chapter 2, one. I say, set the Adam, see Fred, you are one of you. And one, 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 Adam, you are one of you. The best for us, you know. I say, Sarah, you are one of you. But you are one of you, one kind of. Mr. Genesis 2, you are one of you. Set the Nipper, you are one of you. E dinu, sara ne ti behe de, e be sine. E ti ni pe numu e wadi e be, tu mi. E ti ene kachira mo se, me grace. Me numa se mo e kura di e be, tu mi. E ti fin niko, me shama no kasa yi. Hallelujah. E san se, ni pa be bre numu kasa a ye de, e di wana tu e fiase. E di wana tu, hum hum mo e fiase. O kera ni biye na no, e fa wo numu kasa. Na ya chura tu soro. Na osura ye de, a jia tu. Si Adam kasa ya eno sura nyantu mwa kaisa amri ya tedi ya sisa. Kwa si bodi ya yedei, asisa. Nenye su baibu se sedi ya ofre, nipa fre, muwano, eni ya dienye anu, sarane etibi si ne. Odofu diye ubiye wanuwa kebi ya na sarane beye kwa wati. Ni yebi ya udene bi sarana osuru beji su hama. Ti ebradu se ya sakra ajone no. Ya ya enya ajone mo fufri ya ne sakra ye. Na ojie eye yedia, ojie papapa hana. Raditi mi jeye. Hallelujah. Na yebe ye, yebe fanya mi suna odi amaye. Na kupo nsua, kwa yede odi amaye. Odi ama ni pangam. Inti no, na mi ye mfantu mse, se mi wo mkwa la mi enseng. Na debi ya mi biye manua, na mi di mi mate wo, wo, wo jimi. Wo jimi pa, wo ye kurasi ni. Wo nyimnya ansa on. He. Wo, u u me bo brebi ya, na me bro, na eno ne friendi mi abono wa wo bro umani mi ya, ahu hu so aye evi si ma omo peni pebi ebi ulem, ahu hu omo tiati se 
said, he 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 said, in Jimmy Biaman, Nami Dimmy by Atem, Wunim Yansa, Wed Jimmy, Ube Yese, Ube Bre, said yet, Mammy Fubia, Sebi, Wunim Mudeno, I ye a good Casagu or Masson, not a ne, I ye a ye a chitri ni pebitiso. Say Christ, am you who margin in tears in war, not why when now for fro, am an an saniwa, the cooker and saniwa, not nipanenu massa my day, and what to whom my friends. Sa se se di Adam kain no se di ofre Eve no sa na Eve di no ye na ya kan be se se oba o di kan ye friend be be Eve wan e tu ni di Adam ti se di nyami enu ma se mi e wo tu mi no sa nsu no hu sa tu mi ni gu ye mu e ma ye be ye de be akra ti asifo inti ni ifi Adam asini mu e na nipa akura tu mi e wo ye enu ma se mu inti e nyam wa wa se o kan ma tu twelve wa na. Yes, you see, in the moment, mo am an yamu an. Now, mo dear, being so any day, any day. Now, you be a baby being a no cabian, obey boom, my count. And I know this as a kind. Yes, you can. I said, you be free, nipa, but any more baby and wedded, obey boom, dear baby, a counter. Every word that is proceeding out of our mouth, we shall be held accountable unto it. So, as a spiritual being, with your understanding being enlightened from today, know how to carry yourself. Weigh in your words and your thoughts and ask your inner man, is this word that I'm going to speak out, is it worthy of the nature of God like me to speak in this manner? Before I open my mouth and talk, I need to analyze that within my soul. Let the spirit search within that words, go through it and see if it is befitting a born again, Holy Spirit, tongue speaking believer to spew that out into the air. Because as I speak it out, the heaven responds. And in the same manner, if we believe what we just said is true, then know that if you are praying, have that same belief that as you are speaking it, so it shall be what? Declared in heaven. Matthew chapter 18, verse 18. He said, whatever you will bind shall have already what? Been bound. And when you lose it, it is what? Already loosened. And so imagine every day you are spewing nonsense to your child. What are you telling the heavens to declare on that child? He said the child is foolish. So the soul will grow up and become a foolish being. A foolish nature and attitude that child is going to demonstrate. Hallelujah. You are telling you, you are a disobedient child. Look at your face. Look at this. Look at your mouth. Look, and then... Even if we don't even speak that our brain is cursing the child out because we are super angry. I am, I am the chief uh, uh, person. I've been doing that. And every day the Holy Spirit is convicting my heart. Stop speaking to the children in that manner. Because the Holy Spirit lives within my spirit. And he knows that it is not good. It is wrong. And it doesn't mean that you won't correct your children but know how to talk to them. Hallelujah. Talk to them with wisdom. We can correct them with the rod of discipline, all right. But know when you are speaking negatively into their soul. And as the, the soul is receiving and receiving that, so it shall become. And so we have so many ladies, we have so many people their nature is so, they are so timid, they are so fearful. In fact, they can't come out and, and do anything for themselves. Why? Because right from childhood, they've been oppressed and they've been suppressed. They've been emotionally abused and mentally what? Abused. Their soul has been abused for far too long. And so they, they know that what you are saying is true, but they are scared to make a move. Why? Because their mother used to. Do, if, you make a move, I will, I will kill you. 
They have killed their soul long time. They've been killing that child so long time. You, you go there. I'm going to destroy you. I will kill you. I will curse you. I will. And so that is all the soul knows. The soul has been changed in that abusive ways. I pray that you are catching what I'm saying. Because that is the nature of some people's life. Especially from Africa. Especially from Africa. Whether you are living with your biological parents or a stepmother or a stepfather, they, are, they will abuse you one way or the other. All because they are ignorant of the power they carry. They are simply ignorant. They believe that talking to you with that authoritative way and, and using those high, cursive words make them above you. That will make you disciplined or make you obey. But it has brought the worst of many people. The worst. I tell you the truth. Many people are not, they are matured physically, but their soul is like a baby. I tell you, their soul still operates in a baby nature. It takes the power of the Holy Ghost to liberate that soul. It takes the power of the Holy Ghost that will give a new breath to their spirit, be, to be born again in their spirit, for them to be delivered. Many people hear the word. They are too shy to go and tell that white guy in their uh, job or that white lady because they have felt inferior long, long since. They feel inferior to that white person. Why? Back home, when we see a white person, oh, bro, ni koko ma che, we will follow them. We sit, and my grandmother will tell you, eh, eh, in our days, they tell that when you see the white man, you've seen God. Don't even bother to go and look for God. Can you imagine? When you see the white man, you've seen God. And I'm not being racist. I'm telling you the reality of what some people have endured. So why wouldn't the black man feel inferior in their soul? Why wouldn't they always be doing yes, Amasa, and be succumbing instead of rising to be who God wants them to be? And even at work, they'll be doing yes, Amasa, even when they are in authority. And I'm not saying disrespect people, but to do things in confidence, many people don't have because of the power of the word. This is what Jesus is, is, is teaching us tonight as we expand on the body, soul, and spirit. It's about time we know the truth to liberate us, to become the tr true nature, the true beings that we are born to be. Hallelujah. Yama minum, yam suanum, one hour titi, you know, dear Tamsa, you can can be a colano, your banner, be a piano, a mantem. What's that? Yes, you, Ubayasha, walk with ye, you panny beny non and uncle Focus. Sansa Necran, your catching so bayasha walk with ye, ya conda micran. No one neighbors in you, but being annoyed, I can no man some idea. Egoniso. I said, Ya Adam Cassa, ya, ya free Eve, Eve, Bessie Neno. Saran and Nippe be Adam or Sinni Biano, ya Cassa, Eddie, or Sro Yede, a gesso, or Sro Yede, or Sro Gesso. Sans was it the umber teacher was as his own, or Yede, or teacher was so. As the most animals who was as his own, or Eddie, or son in Warsaw. Tia Domi Domi, a massa, I mean, for being a it's not so person exercise to control. Person, I call any surono. Now you are brono. I did be any other people, but boy, in Santo Bosco, did be a no crano. I have potty. Oh, being in the crana. Why one no crana? Oh, I feel one poor. Oh, no, to me, and and the animal because the what on a crana a day. I have potty. So, oh, to me, the animal crana. Oh, by a worse than the animal made the animal. Now, boss is sat a you know. Hmm hmm. A day he ne a one ni pan a crasso. Now the corn a masso. To was a transfer if I want to trust if you wish so, Neko wish so, if you wish so, Neko wish so. Tine papa ne eya tembi dia oba befa. Tine odebe koni kunso be dini kuna temwa be dini kuna temwa. It's not a Christian you. We are taking a scroll and we say me ko peni. Be be chani kunsa. I didn't hear. Sani dia tetemo. Ne kra na tembi dia ni dia shani kra ne ma. Ye ne kra ne ni mono. They are kind of shame, so near more and more and more. When you are my prayer, yeah, you put it there also, you will no one say, or could talk to Isa. 
Prama who brassy. And so now was ankle rising above the oil. Yes, dear, oh, moon, nipple, who are not said, but a two million years, and some will be moment, and none dear, ne crown, or ya bottom out could swim in the left from the right. Ya all gone, you want blow for old Bruni Coco Machi, ya near do much, as you hung me. Then I know when you're the baby cock, I say, Mamma, I just say, Amma, eh, son, you're so who she are Brunia, who call you Hunyami, who she are Brunia, son, what she, well, who yammy. Now say, we ain't Nipa, ya can't say, I shall wipe you now, what to come to our food with my cat was a yes to do. Or you will yammy on our yes to baby and our cartoon. In the end, before you go, you should say, Well, that's it. What do I must say yes to them? Because already in your cat and said, Bruno, you yammy. What to me, a airplane? What to me, a way, and to me, maybe. And to me, a yammy, yes, yes, I see it. Well, my general. Well, in summer, yak, a man and yes, so to me. Na a d and them. Na a d in the way and so. You know, must send to me, woman, out of four. Se would be one or crack, be an anocassa, a far no no pia. To me, a day be a pie. Now, so jisso. Nams are home morning, or morning, nams are only busy bodies. Se was them work a kind job chapter one verse six. Econ. Now, go on with us that as a woo, only nams will call him. Or see me, we are some watching chair change, no call from no abasso, or call from no abasso, or we wait a tray, a mood damp pine, no acushim, no a two diacoyans and phone, or we are the bad yabis with jisso. Hallelujah. The bread you see, my dear, who said in me, as ya yeni pedi, as ya fa. Eno hum hum, what's your mouth open now? Where they? Oh, ye ye, mu eju ma, e ye nyame hum kuku. Inti asa na ube biwa no akasa chira ubano. Ma asam na anko ukre ni mu. Ne busa hum hum said ye mi biwa ma no akeng. E ye insurance ma mi banana. E be mana ni na be yo brain pombi. E be mana ni na be ye de. Ye mi catch me ni ano. E be mana ni ni wo Christo sum. Ana se be brain Christo sum as. Or don't you coupon or no, no, why ye in his suit and any bind so. Now, okay, first Corinthians thirteen seven one or so, or doc a car at the end in our so, and shall I then a bonny moon and a papa and one. Tis a no, I shall cram, mamma. Unyan yard yen your cry, or don't I shall cram man in tea. Now, so no home man in tea, who see a yahi. Now, what pay or doc wine so, and while approaches any pano. Um, can it be a bad man? The crown I had a damp in him. The bad man and your bunny, who so Nelson, the old Cosuyan, or Bayen ye, am I a day already? Nelson Yantisa. Ya, 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 Christo, sooner did it for now, pull him down. Yet, twin for signs away, it was that the Encosiaga. Or the Nanoe, they add domain at the corner, a yen yammy dumano away. Cucucucu no, ye Encosishi, ye no master, no, two me womb at the four. Then ye be a knocker. Why ye soon in a bye soon? Dina ye ye. Na mi bien anon or se or srum ran or sro by a form ran a by. Or dinner numa sem ye de abwadi. Yan should ye de numa sem stayadi. Nti wine ye ye jane hwine. Bon sama na nyami. Na mi bien anon se de enye hine ne ye hine. Yan should ye ye bien e soon ye mana ye de ye can buya bra bosun ye ma dear so any a fufru because ye time wom. Na mi omwaye. Umye ya hum hum no, inti asi ni wa yi. Na yente nasi yi. The last part we want to touch on, and then if you have any question, you will ask, and then we will pray. Like I said, the spirit and the soul is a full grown being. They are fully grown and they are mature being, meaning they are already structured as adults. Let me put it that way. But as a baby is born, it's like a, an, a matured spirit and, and a grown or an adult spirit and soul that lives in that baby. Let's get that understanding. The soul of that baby is not a baby soul. It's an, it's a, it's an adult soul. It's an adult soul. But it's going to operate on the level of that physical body according to the physical body and the environment. Hallelujah. According to the physical body and the environment where they were born. And so uh, if I, like in my home, God is the one reigning here in my home. Why? Because I'm a believer. I always ask the spirit of God to take over. So I have little children. In them, they may have a little body, but in them, it's, a, it's an adult soul, an adult spirit that lives in them. And it is up to me 
It is up to me. It is for me. God is looking up to me to train my child in the way of the Lord so that the soul and the spirit being in them will be trained, will be educated on the matters of the word of God. To know God and to serve God. Hallelujah. To know God and to what? Serve God. And if a soul and a spirit grow up in a baby, in a, an environment where there is no God, or they are not serving Jesus Christ, maybe in a traditionalist place, in a fetish priest home, that soul and that spirit is going to conform to whatever that body is trained to know and to do. Hallelujah. But in the course of time, if they are matured and they get out of the parents' home, and someone preach Christ to them. And someone preach Christ to them. And their spirit open up to receive Christ. Their spirit and their, their spirit become born again. Their spirit being becomes what born again because they have what accepted Jesus into them. And the Holy Spirit will come and what dwell in them. Then whoever brought them to Christ whatever the church, wherever the church they may go, then it's up to the church and the leaders to now train the spirit and the soul to know the things of God by teaching them the foundations, everything about the word. So sometimes the one who has been in Christ, the spirit being and the soul that has been taught right from their childhood and the one who was doing something else, before they became born again, you see the level is not the same. It will take the one coming from the other background much effort to study and to get trained, train their, their spirit to know God. It's just like you taking a child to school. Why do you take the child to school? To study, to train the brain, to know the things that they don't know. Hallelujah. To train that, to know what they don't want to know. And so if you are coming from a background where Christ was never taught you, you didn't, you didn't know about Jesus Christ right from childhood, it is up to you to bring your spirit and your soul up to speed with the word of God, full knowledge of him. Educate yourself. And that's what we are doing now. Hallelujah. Because until you train that spirit being, the body may be acting contrary to the, to the word that you have accepted in your spirit. So you see, someone has come to Christ. They even speak in tongues. Yet they fornicate. They will still be in fornication. Why is that? Why would that happen? Why should that happen? Because after receiving Jesus and after being born again, it doesn't end there. It's not enough. We will expand on it by tomorrow, God willing, or Monday, we'll pick it up from there. Because after being born again in the spirit of God, is now you have to be taught the word more so that your spirit being and your soul will be renewed and will be born again and will receive this word. You know, you will walk, you begin to train yourself and know the patterns of God, what pleases God and what doesn't please God. And so if they don't take you from the basics and start from the top somewhere, you will catch it all right, but you can't handle it because the flesh will, will try to what, overcome the spirit that has received the Holy Spirit. The flesh is always like a tag of war with the spirit being. It's in the book of Galatians 5. The flesh is always trying to do all the things that the eye is seeing, that is flashy, that is pleasurable, that is enjoyment. But the spirit who has now come to receive Jesus is now trying to seek what heavenly things. Because that spirit being has heard that it is not good to go and party and boogie and fornicate. So the, the spirit being in you will try and communicate with your soul and tell the soul, so please don't do this again. You are not supposed to do this because you have been born again. It takes the word of God daily within the spirit. It takes the word of God daily within the soul for the soul to be reminded and renewed every day to bring the soul to speed with the spirit being. 
that has been born again. If not, you can receive the Holy Spirit baptism, speak in tongues, yet your flesh will still control. Because your flesh is very strong. It's the one that is in the physical, right? It's like he's the one that is in control. And so he's always trying to force the soul to do things, to use the soul to do whatever. So the spirit being has to be strong in prayer and in the word so that it can now take over the soul and command the flesh to what? To obey. So we'll dig deeper into that. Maybe God willing tomorrow or next week Monday when we pick up again. And Friday we'll use it to pray more so that God will grant us deeper revelation as he has laid this foundation for us. Hallelujah. So I'm going to end here so that you can ask questions. Rafua, ya kwa Hallelujah. And you need that. But I bet na baby, body. In the better I said, the baby, you know, or be the trick a crack a crack a crack a coffee, and if I crown bed, a bingy, a colour crown bed, a bingy. In the sir, me yet did in ya, be jitty send your home team, nor they be a friend who grew fear. Not they be a name in my kind Bible and son of my day. Me training or more home, any or more crown, so won't wear ready. Sabaya will nina, why are they own freedom? Unina, ni kran bi unse zese ni pebi ane yini unti no mami nyadi e ya chere me ya chere me from kola bi no afi mami nfaye de emobra na odi koto tu obi ya ya wona tu kremo sumo wo Iraq pebi so ne huu no ne ne kran e matured e ne ti baby nim but obi yini no makaranta ni adi no beko ni achen kora ni achen se Jesus bi ane wo na mi bi ane waka Allah Allah so ya bosom. Yeah, a home home fin and an anonymous are in Gino, sir. I do be a more do be a swaman. Now one tea crystal being can. Was open in a musa, not a companion. Name of my dumba dum so. Now a cottage will be say yes, so a man qua. Branding chain, no bema de ben qua near the no be any home. And a radian, I do know what me be a womb, the edgy sign and yes, and I was a home cocoa a day. I bow running home, no bonnet. And only born again, I will fall from. I'll be born as you better expand on it more. And the banana, I feel not a drew said, The Oka, some man, the panacea crying. I was so dinner, yes, some and money panano peliana, and I do, and I bring you a bene bian, not all church, and near Obana wuna, I won't want whom whom whom. Jumedia was a de odi. I genuinely was a old genuine, what you hold the beer and a peliana, near my bend, I was all genuine. Was a old genuine. And near my bain, your original, and I'm more bain, or say they could too far. In the Nabani Sape, a fit in Nippon, so oh, the first time I could disquay, sigh and sonya meany. To my bay, whom we need the mean could disco with him. Ah, brother, I am in any tree, a boy, the man, Sam, me, I'm in the Pedian, I'm saying, the Pedian, so the same, my dear, yes, with the Wabet's name in the Pedian. A better name, whom Yamin soon piffing, in ten year, mini brand in your day, and chain penabi. Two bones, a woman, a son, a mere Sam now, whom made you now. O pusu di ma o kranu. Na o kranu e sheni pedu ya neso. Na wa yede wa dibo ni neso. Na sa amani sa. Na nchile chile ya. Ebe ma o kranu. Hum hum no. Enyini. Na we nyanti ya siye. Na wakacho o kranu. Se he o kranu. Me nye sa ebi. Na o kranu enti nyanti ya ni pedu ya. Se he ni pedu ya. Me nkwa ebi. Me nye se ebi mwa. Upa bo mpa ye gra wama. Ne sheni nkwa mu gra wama. Oba sa ako bo nini mu. Oba sa ako ye. Upa ma nene kaka sa fufro wo wia si nina hansi. Still, Baba will wear your mind. I didn't hear. Ne cran, ne home, no. Onyanya, yasem, the Abeman, any amanantia, says, We in ye, we in a ye, we in a maunini when you mimu ye, we in a ma we yet ye sonya meni. Hallelujah. It yet a king treachery, yes, sumo, and treachery. Yamimu asem. Hm, yasema yatris and asema, a tre, crum crum ye, and ya do more, ya dear bar don't swam out. Ha, tu bo se ama hum hum no afi de no ni no pick up. Ati se de odo ba ko school na odo ko fa nurse mu na afa primary mu na afi obeni no se maya doctor maya se na afi o o bob bra fata sa ya chida no no o tu mo anamu tu hum hum so e wase ye ko school 
Ese wo hu hu no kosku, oko Bible school. And yes, physical Bible school like a Bible in church. Hallelujah. To boys when you na fe die, o kire o kra no de onye. Na o kra no so o she hu na bia say ye ni say, me nya ne sa. Ti boys a pray pray no be kosu die. Na so se nya me asem no do so mo a. O bo nse wati me di wo hu na bia ne so. Afi wo na obo adwaman wo mo bia. Wo na wa no e ya se den. Obi ba be tu ani so because ah Christ don't e. Me dey tell. Na fi obi bo say eh as soon as he pen, and I yet didn't attend my papa and his wife. Well, soon I walk over the day, and you nipe was sacrampa. Then a man is sacre, a yamia semna, a bet na hum nim, and a atianip or crano. Now I send it, baby, and a shammy day, what you may din a mere semnish or day, a man a yee, Namimo, and no mere adventures anywhere. A beckon was some more, and I saw China, and I sent a man din. A radi and no me. Na ye ko de insu no oma adwinu nti asem na bebre yo fa bebre nki ka ho maye o yesu christo de if you have any question you can ask before we will pray we will pray effectively we will pray according to the word that has come to us amen maybe i said something in still that is that not click in your mind ask the holy spirit is the teacher he's here hallelujah Hey, students, we are supposed to ask questions and the teacher will answer. The teacher is here. Holy Spirit will answer you. Hey, you can raise your hands and ask questions. You can unmute yourself and ask questions. Yes, ma. Um, praise the Lord. Um Foley. We patrol maybe some question about um Embofra to say me to turn out what can be said. You read Bible to them. And to me, person, because I'm more fat out of if you want to think, you think, you know, among TBBS, you know, is it necessarily to read Bible to them when they go to bed? That's my question. Thank you. I mean, so. And what's not, what's not, may come off from us and panic, whom whom from the end of Fratia when you're me and you. Then she may say you question and this is. Eh, baby, na oda na asun wong. Ni mum mum na yepe ni mum mum ni kura. Baby, na oda na asun ogu tape ni mum mum. Onya eh ni be ni body ni ne ya pala. Ati ase. Aye ti se ni anku pwa. Wada ni wabeshe eh body kitu e muche meri yem. Nane ti se mun kasam pumi no. Eh wa bini. Inti biya wu kambi ya ano akola ano wati. Ati inti na doctors eti mi anya sa ni biya ni se. O akolani se ya funkura o de kasa chen tonyo mtire no. Ana opin fo be na doctor nka sa nchire wo. Ande no kure. Doctor nka nchire da se impo akolani se ya funu o tonyo mje na akolani te. Ah. Okay. Doctor fo na e de no hu ye. Hwe a doctor fo no mo person be ak na le di se nyame ye nyame na o mo keka nse mu. O mo read the bible no. But o mo o mo read the bible no but o mo nyi ndu. What they say o mo read the bible and they no se nyame asem ye. And you know, Yamin, I be a man, you mean, I be a woman, you know, who say, I'm a friend now, I say, you know, or could a penny, you know, the penny, and you didn't be a woman, be our day, or tea. And you know, back out, you know, but what the side or the nipper, a common sense, the bedroom, much, you know, the India, and the way almost a what tea, but a spiritual thing, because whom who met here for Lanimo. Any a a a a so a ne hum hum any ni soul ne hum hum ni spirit ne any ni soul ne kran e ya matured dada e ya adult dada what they say then so abesha body kitu em aha and then they walk and biya what they walk and biya what now they watch na me me tell you ne me na me dey ato e ne me biya ko bi e di e di a dance epe abofra o kuto no hum hum na akula ne tuwa kasa. No, Sam, no, no, you before and was a cat. Oh, baby, and no, what to Zakula, Kitu, what to have been for the TV, and no, Zakula's a head. I didn't know it was your Danima, mean, what the no one, not been for the farm. Sanana, my mini bomb pie, and my mini empire, and I'll buy a bay for now to make the Akolano at one thing, and I'll plan it to hold in or home. It is home from that Tim Colano, a year mature. Home from a Tim Colano. Eh, yang macam tu, dia macam ni, betul kan? Masih ambil beri. Entah no, eh, hujan apa? Saya, wah, wah, waktu ayah ini nyumbur cerewo. Nau kan yang mian sembilan ni, cerewo. Wah, macam apa? Pak, engkau bayar buat, so muncir engkau bayar buat asal cerewo fra. Eh, kau yang onfaso. 
no ye de onyi na wa ye de man free hu na na ye na ye ze ye bi mi so mu ni nyansa sin nya mi ndi no o wa ya kula o ma ni nya nkwala ade o ma ni nya se bo se wa sha kula ni tetu akula no be nyini na te bi gimi se mu ko ano di ban kan nyansa di bi an tra kula ni bi bo so se akula ni ya akula na so de ti akula ni mu nya akula amen o de wotram se be ka ho asem pi ti kanya mi asem te no ah me man every day be be ka ye kai one chapter Ha, you were the book of Matthew. There be a kind one chapter. I didn't hear because Bible said, "Men shall not acquire our end day." On fast from when you are on your day, we free you. You are on your from there. Yes, we be busy. And then yes, we be busy. I say, "Who? What did say about running man? What did say about running man? Free you? Yeah, we are not the man. I say no free you. So what? Yeah, not the man. Now, when I be a when you want to say no create the man, eh, we man you know and catch it. Any time be able for another baby will be as so yet teenager so yet day. But more than five coins be sooner day. Put your money aside, man. And care to cry. Put a swara ya ne mami. Amen. Put a swara. For for India, we are so ne can your money aside, my children. Can your money ever be bem? Any late da? Ya ye late ni di ya kwa chef umati. Ya ye late ni di ya chef fridi mo. Ah wo wo. Two boys ya throw the the late ashumesi. The late. Onu di ya si de wa ye late. The ni di oti aside. Hallelujah. God bless you. Amen. Mm -hmm. uh, our sister was asking whether as babies are they, uh, can they hear anything? Do they know? And I was explaining that they are mature spirit. And uh, God willing, tonight God will come. Jesus will come. But if he tarries to come because of a soul that needs to be saved, we will continue tomorrow and we will expand further. The spiritual being, the entities and, and the, their true natures too and some of the things that happen in the spiritual realm. We are going to touch on both the positive spirit, which is the spirit of God, and the negative, and how they fight over the soul of a man. Hallelujah. There are some things that some people experience when they were children. We're going to touch on all that so that you know where you stand. Some people need deliverance. After this session, if you need deliverance, you need to come. God will pray for you, and the Lord will deliver you. Because some people are speaking in tongues, but they still need deliverance. They still need to be delivered from certain things so that their souls will be set free. Patrol with a question. If you have a question, ask. If not, then we'll pray. Of all the things. Here, there's no shy, shy, shy. They are not shy. Don't be shy of anybody. It's only respect. We respect ourselves. But we are not shy. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Yes, ma. Kasa. Amen. But now, I feel answer nice out by a number of people say, Come and young perform a bow when I'm not to a crown or son or bow any pan. Send any pan a crown, son or bow when I'm on a catastrophe, said the age, Miss Anne. A ten answer nice out by the said when you're going to bow or bow any person is such an uncle, maybe such a crown. Now, go on any ye if you mean answer nice out, mamma, say, or bow any person a crown. It's sexual That's right. It's That's right. It's 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 Catch and you say, Oh, why, Yemi, you cry, and so is your mamma, you too. Why, my grey hair, Bamitin? But any beam in the edge. I say, I hate grey hair. I hate it. My mother hate it. My sisters hate it. I'm going to dye my hair. I'm a panic to this mammy and call and call dye. The dark grey is your glory. Don't do that. I'm telling you, Rosalyn, I hate my grey hair. I hate it. And I was like, Lord, I have you on this show. <laughs> Why would you say time? I'm going to see a tiny one. I said, grey hair, no, eh, baby. Eh, you the time, time, man. To a person who has grey hair. To a boy, you know, I could die. You pay us what is 60, 60, 61 years. To grey hair, but you know, you're there. You know, you're a person who has grey hair. You know, it's all from the enemy. It's all from the enemy. He makes us hate ourselves. And if you do that, you are hating God because God sees Himself in you. 
God put his nature in us so that he can love himself through us. We are containers. We contain his glory, his nature, which is light and life and love. And so when we begin to do contrary, then it is the enemy that is making so that God can hate us. He hates, he hates God and he hates humanity. Why? Because we look like God. He doesn't look like God. The angels were never created in the image of God. See, angels, they don't have feelings. So they don't have emotions. So when God tells them, go and strike, they just, one touch, they will strike. They will not think twice. They will not blink. They will not have mercy. Because they were called up. We were created. We were formed. God took his time with us. Tell yourself, I am a special being. From this minute for I will never let the enemy tell me I am ugly and, and this. Sometimes he will enter into a husband, a wife, a child and tell you are ugly, you are wicked, you are this. It is, it is a lie from the pit of hell. Don't accept it and don't believe it. And don't let that thing weigh you down. You are nothing of whatever description they want to give you. You are loving, you are love. You are embodiment of love. And you must appreciate it that way. If not, we will never see the glory of God, nor see his face. We are never inferior beings. If you, if you don't believe it, go and read Psalm, Psalm 8, the book of Psalm, verse 8. He said, who is man that you are so mindful of, that you have made us a little below God? We are a little below God. He, we are just like, we are just in his image. He has all power and we have some power. That's why we are little below him, but we are exact replica. God has emotions. And if the book of Ephesians will tell you that don't make the Holy Spirit to grieve. Why is the Holy how come how, how, the Holy Spirit is a being, it's not an it, it's a being, a full being living in your spirit. And I've already told you, your spirit man is a being and a matured being. If not, Holy Spirit cannot live in, in him or her. Hallelujah. Picture that and you, you will see. And that is why he has emotions. Holy Spirit, he has emotions. He is God. So you have emotion, you think you have attitude. He can also have an attitude. But his is good. And that's why we must emulate. We must avail ourselves so that he will be filled fully in us. And when he does that, now you have what we call, I don't care. I don't care means even when they are, they are you know, taking off the head. You say, for Christ's sake, I'm ready to die. You don't care about that. So when you say, oh, she will money now fully. Now when you're your friend, auntie, you think I am can I am can I can say, oh, no, what to two man? What to two four man? That that that. Fede, what what is that? Fede, jump. What do you say for? Fede, baby, say, hey, a queer pani, yeah, pana. And then the Abushia said, "You didn't tell me what you were." Hey, and you, 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 and Silence means concern. It just say tears here. It means we've all understood, right? And we are going to walk in the nature and the likeness of God. May God bless us. Amen. The next three, four minutes, you are praying effectively. Pray according to the word. Hallelujah. Amen. Uh, today, the Lord was giving me some emphasis that because maybe because I said, when you, you don't pray and quote the word, uh, the Lord will never listen to you anything. Don't take it that way. There are some people, they are babies. Spiritually, they are babies. They, are, they need to be trained. They don't also know the word. They, they can't read it. In the case of those people, the Holy Spirit intercedes on their behalf. So when they open their mouth and they are speaking gibberish, the Spirit of God stands in the gap for them until they come to the knowledge whereby they're able to read, they're able to catch some of the uh, Bible verses and use it to pray. Hallelujah. So let me chip in that so that uh, the enemy will not come and say, hey, 
thing. They said you, you didn't use the word of God, so God is not listening. It's, it's not in that manner. But those of us who can read and meditate, let the word speak. Use the scripture. Quote God his word. Hallelujah. Challenge him with his word because he has exalted that word above his name. Amen. 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 Because she said, Obeba, San in the air, Quan was to say, I feel what picket quotations may be. I feel who can say, Radiwa some say, Radiwa some say. Obey, Obey, Yam, what name? Because he's so bit my day, a drusa, a bian, Hanty, Mamma Bibian, two in Tibia, a war on five. Let's begin to pray. You are thanking God, and whatever your expectation is, begin to pray. Begin to pray. Massa, Brandy, Rebo Shandaya. Kingdom bros kabori and let's all mute our mics and pray together. Itaya masunda rabashande. Hinda bros kabanda rabashande. Lebre kabayando rabashande riyama ande. Kalo stablam dene kishu kori anda ya. Me stablunda e mani kubande. Bista boro mushe kiri anda ya masunda rabande rabashande. Iba ba ba lo lo lo. Father, you have spoken to the word of us because of the word that you have made us to You are maturing us. Yes, I see you maturing us. I see you maturing our spirit being. I see you maturing our spirit being. Thank you. Thank you. Bless your name, O Lord. For the mature words that we have perfect <laughs> Mary <laughs> and in our physical being, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus, in the mighty 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 name of Jesus, in the 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 name of Jesus, in
I keep coming all the pregnant women in our ministry to you. All the pregnant women, all our guests, all the pregnant women, our guests, our citizens, oh Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ, let the blood of Jesus continue to protect them. Let the blood of Jesus protect them, oh Lord. Father, grant them the Hebrew women's favor, oh Lord. Grant them the Hebrew women's favor, oh Lord. Those who are due and past due, those who are on the verge of, of, of even pushing out the baby. In the name of Jesus, let there be an ease. Delivery ease in the name of Jesus. Take delivery in the name of Jesus. And I declare delivery in the name of Jesus. Any blood issues, whatever it may be, Mr. Jesus, Holy Spirit, take control. 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 God bless you for making the time to come under the feet of Jesus Christ. You didn't come to man, but to Christ. Hallelujah. We don't have a word unless the Lord speak unto us. Hallelujah. And we know as we base on scripture, you know that it is the word of God. Amen. I pray for better understanding, much deeper understanding into what he has started with all of us in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Like I said, the Lord is going to come tonight, okay? Jesus Christ will come tonight. But maybe for a soul's sake, he may tarry to come. And if he does, God willing, if he give us the strength and his mercies is abundant unto us, we will continue to be trained, to be taught under his infinite love and mercy tomorrow night. Hallelujah. With all humility, let's lift our hands for the benediction. May the Lord Jesus Christ, who holds the keys to hell and Hades, may he keep our feet from stumbling. May he open our spiritual intellect to receive this word and even deeper revelation into that which we cannot even interpret. May we walk in his anointing. May we walk in his power and his glory and his mercy 
and his abundant grace from today to every soul in your household and in the churches of God now and forevermore. May we sleep in his beauty and his glory even tonight in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. 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 God bless you. We love you all with the love of God. We love you all. Amen. Amen. Amen.